think about what we have here. We're having over a thousand new managers and assistant directors from 85 countries all across EMEA. I always leave these conferences feeling a greater sense of confidence in the organization, but also just feeling energized. These things are vital. They're part of our culture. They're what makes us special. And so I would never miss one of these. It's such a great energy which is created here, which is the best thing I love about this event. They are what we call the future of Ernst & Young. In a few years, they will be in places of leadership. So it's critical that this group of people really know one another. We think that it is so important to all be on the same page. We are by far the most globally integrated of any organization in this profession. And so really bring our people together is important for us. It's a unique opportunity to meet uh, people from everywhere in the world. It actually puts into practice the whole diversity yeah. slogan and policy we have. But I met lovely people from Ireland last night. I met people from South Africa. We got people from Sweden over there and uh, yeah it's it's great I mean there's really no no barriers you just approach people and say hello where are you from I'm loving it this year because this is the first year we've had everyone from Europe but also people from India and Africa and the Middle East and so we get really interesting groups with people with very very different perspectives on life on work and how they get on with each other. It made people realize that something is happening in the emerging markets. For me it has always been a dream that really every of our 88 countries participate in this event and this dream this year became a reality. It's unbelievable if you see the, the diversity of our people. We're recognizing that the world is changing. What about Africa and the, and the Middle East? First time they've been here. Well if you look at the growth going on in that part of the world, India, Africa, Middle East, enormous growth, enormous opportunity. And so it's really important that we can engage that group of people with some of the uh, people from our mature markets of Europe. Middle East have got quite a different working practice and then as well as you say in India. So it's, it's been, I've really enjoyed that. It's I sat good. next to a guy from um, Nigeria at dinner on the first night. We didn't really talk about work at all. I was just absolutely fascinated by the country, the politics, all of that sort of yeah. thing. An event like this is so critically important because the people that you're sitting in class today you'll be working with some of them 15 years from now. You may not know who. Part of the advantage that we have in creating an environment where people do have fun is that it makes it easier for people to create relationships. And one of the things that we want to achieve in a session like the New Manager Program is that we want people to build relationships and particularly build relationships across country borders. It's really good to meet all these guys. Some of them are just down the road at the office and other ones have been all around the, uh, the other side of the world. Basically at the end of the, these three days I'm expecting to have, I don't know, at least 10, 15, 20 uh, people, profiles that I know. Uh, one day if I'm going to need an expert on that side of the business, on that aspect of the business, I can just pick the phone or uh, fire an email and uh, put up a team very quickly together. Being here away from your daily work is very good since it provides a platform to just try things. When I come back to work, I will probably be facing client issues, I will be facing my partner, my managers, everybody is expecting something from me. Here, they just try to focus on yourself, try to learn from each other, and this is just like a playground to some extent where we can really practice. There was one important uh, statement that one of the facilitators made today. He um, talked about stopping and starting. Um, stopping old ways of thinking, old ways of working, and starting to work in new ways, express or demonstrate new behaviors. Um, just generally start thinking about the future, about long term. I learned how to uh, take into account different communication styles that people may have, how to adapt your own uh, behavior to motivate people who might be a different style than you are yourself. The fun part definitely was when, when we worked in groups yeah. of, of peers, like people of the same social style, and it took about two minutes and, and you could figure out which style was sitting on which table. It was good having, having a session since it was um, not only client-centric stuff that we were doing here, it was more about people. I'm going to be more energized and motivated to be doing what I'm doing because this is essentially a welcome to the next level like I'd like to call it. But I think that there is something within the Ernst & Young culture that we hold dear and that is we want to have fun. Every single one of us spends more time at work than we do doing anything else other than sleeping maybe. And so if I'm going to spend so much time at work, I want to have fun in what I'm doing and I want to have fun with the people I'm working with. And so when we get 
a couple of thousand people together, I really want them to have a good time and to leave feeling good about life and the organization. It's a major, major, great, great success. If you look at the responses from facilitators, from participants, from support team, not to forget, and they enjoy so much in being here and, and meeting other people. In EMEA we have so many opportunities, but if there is one thing I would like to emphasize with this event, it's so great for networking. Oh, great time, great time. I'm meeting a lot of people, very, uh, very good people. The show is great, the food was really great. Last night was really great because people were really squeezing the last drop of energy out of them by partying. I had better mornings, but uh, I can still manage the lessons and the classes and uh, yeah, everybody knows it was big fun last night. There's a camel outside and we're, uh, that is just was intrigue. What is going to happen with the camel? There's, surely it's going to be combined the activity somewhere. I'm, I'm hoping rides around the uh, hotel. It's always great with Z-Y. <laughs>